Hi, I'm Jeff Snell, Superintendent of Vancouver Public Schools. As we begin graduation week, we wanted to hear from some of our incredible seniors as they transition to life after high school. We interviewed hundreds of seniors to find out what worked for them and what we could improve upon to make school the best place it can be. Afterward, some of them were willing to share their thoughts on camera. Today we're speaking with students from Fort Vancouver High School Center for International Studies. My favorite staff member will have to be Steve, and he's an admin here. And I feel like that's my favorite because he's always kept through with me. I could always go to him for honest advice and for any problems that I have. And he's a staff member that looks like me, so I'm more comfortable with speaking to him. And yeah, I relate with him a lot. Like the first one that stands out, um, she works here, um, Hannah Buell. She is probably my favorite, and I've had her all four years since my freshman year. She's the ASL teacher here and she's just always like there to support me like I can always go to her for advice like I you can tell that she really like cares about her students and wants them to succeed. Uh, Miss McIntyre at Fort because um, again she also helps me a lot and uh, she doesn't make me feel bad like if I don't have a way to come to school a lot because um, I'm not here some of the time and uh, she doesn't say anything about it she just helps me get right back into it and yeah she's I'm really lucky to have a teacher like her. A lot of my teachers um, tried to pre prepare me mostly for like stuff like work, um, which I think is really important. Like one of my classes now is like, I'm a TA, so you do a lot of um, like work on ethics and how to be a good employee, which I think is very valuable. All the counselors, even if they're not your counselors, because we have like counselors based on our last names, even if like my counselor is Dillman, he will prepare me for life. He will like tell me what I need to do, tell me like the steps to get there, but then like Jackie Nelson, she's not my counselor, but she will push me to get where I want to go. Like everyone at Ford just wants you to succeed. My best moment as a student, I would have to say, is when I started getting involved in clubs and stuff, and I became the president of a club, of Black Student Union. So that was one of my proudest moments, like the best time for me, because I felt so much more involved in the school than I did any other years that I was in school. One of my best moments here at VPS was um, the ASL showcase, and like performing that, it, like it really makes, like I really, I really enjoy ASL, and I've been studying it for years, and. Um, it really makes me feel like I have succeeded in something and so it kind of gives me like motivation to like keep going. Because I was so shy, I like held myself back a lot. But like senior year, I, like, I was like, I want to do that, so I'm going to do it. So I think that's my biggest advice. Do it because you want to do it, not because, oh my gosh, I don't want to do it because I'm scared. Uh, I'd say just don't get discouraged and um, like if you're having a really hard time, I mean there's always after school classes and everything that uh, teachers can help you with. Uh, yeah, so yeah, just basically don't d get discouraged. I think you should be your hardest, I think you should be the hardest on yourself your freshman year because that's when you're going to build those good habits and if you don't build them early on you're going to get into the same habits of like procrastinating and like putting things off and it's going to be so hard to break that unless you start it from the very beginning. I see myself hopefully becoming a therapist in the next couple of years. I want to go to Clark and study into like psychology. I'm not sure like what field. Yeah, that's why I need to go to Clark so I can figure that out 100% and be sure and set on it before I transfer into a four year. So I want to go to Clark for two years and then do my prereqs and then try to do dental hygiene. As an adult, I'm honestly not entirely sure what I see. I do know that um, I, I'm, I am sure that I'll be like successful because I have people in my life that'll be there for me. From a 1 to 10, I'm going to say a 10 because I'm really excited to get it started. I'm nervous to step into the real world, but I know I can handle it. I think I'm pretty helpful for my future. I think that I've started to set up some good habits for myself, so I think I'm pretty helpful for that. I'm very helpful. Um, I used to not be, but like I think after being in Fort for a while, 
it has made me more hopeful and um, being successful in high school has made me feel more ready to be successful out of high school. Congratulations to the Fort Vancouver High School class of 2022. We are so proud of you Trappers. We can't wait to see the impact you will have on our community and the world.